Hello everybody, my name is Jimmy Scalia, and I'm excited to bring you a great matchup today between the Bishop O'Dowd and the Tory Pines. Just to go through the starting lineup for both sides, for the hometown Pines, their starting lineup is number 2, Kevin Hall, number 5, Roy Torres, number 10, Brian Coleman, number 20, Jesse Wood, and number 32, Chris Miller, switching over to the Bishop O'Dowd at number 5, Stephen Kelly. Number 11, Sean Harris. Number 12, Alan Parker. Number 20, Frank Powell. And number 32, Justin Wilson. I'm very excited for this matchup today. And we're about to see a lot of offense between these teams as Bishop O'Dowd wins the tip off. It goes to Justin Wilson inside, misses the shot, gets his own rebound, and gets it back out to Frank Powell for the first score of the game. So the road visiting Bishop O'Dowd. Score first in this matchup. And now it'll be the Tory Pines looking to match it right here. Kevin Hall, that's a bad pass, nearly a turnover. Chris Miller has it, and he gets stripped. Number five, Stephen Kelly with the ball, pushing it up the court. Now to Wilson, flips it out to number 12, Alan Parker. Parker to Sean Harris. Sean thought about the three, now drives in, misses the lay, offensive rebound. Powell puts it back in. So Frank Powell with four early points in this matchup. And now Torrey Pines trying to set the offense here. It's Kevin Hall, drives the lane, now passes back outside. A three on the way from number 20, Jesse Wood is off the mark. And a rebound for Stephen Kelly. Kelly to Wilson, they swing it around. Now it's in the hands of Sean Harris. Harris drives inside, gives it to Powell who scores again. Frank Powell. Six early points in this matchup. And the Bishop O'Dowd finding their strides offensively in the early goings of this game. Here come the Pines again. Ball is loose and on the ground. And Justin Wilson ends up with the ball. Back they come here. A three on the way from Allen. Parker is good. And an early timeout for the Tory Pines. After that one, they're trying to get reset in their offense and calm things down. Here comes Kevin Hall. He loses the ball. There's a scramble for it on the court. It's still loosened down, waiting for something to happen. Hall comes up with it, though. No look pass inside to number 30. Lou Brooks with the score, and what a way for the Pines offense to get going in this game. Number 12, Alan Parker stuck in no man's land right there. He finally gets it out to Frank Powell. And now it's Sean Harris has it. Flips it outside to Powell again. Powell, good defense by the Pines here. Forcing him to pick up his dribble. And now it's Alan Parker. Parker, a blocking foul is called on the Pines for that one. And that's Lou Brooks, who was able to get the first field goal for the Pines. He is called for the foul there. We'll see if it is a side out. Yes, they are going to side out. It was not in the act of shooting. And Powell looking for someone. Finally gets it inside. Powell gets it right back. He finds a way to score. But it looks like they're signaling an offensive foul. Frank Powell disagrees with the call. And the Pines catch a break there. Too low with the shoulder from Powell. And it's going the other way. Kevin Hall brings it back up the court. Hall. Pass inside of number 20, Jesse Wood. Wood, back out to Roy Torres. Torres tries the layup, no. Rebound, fought for and claimed by Frank Powell. He seems to be everywhere in the early goings of this game. And now it's in the hands of number five, Stephen Kelly. Chris Miller, great dime inside. Parker, oh, the pump, the layup off the glass is good. Allen Parker gets it to go. And Jesse Wood the other way. Finds the bottom of the net as well. So now a little pace getting going in this game. Both offenses trying to get into a rhythm here as they push the ball up court. Here comes number 12, Alan Parker. Parker inside to Justin Wilson who finds the lay. Bishop O'Dowd finding a lot of offensive success right now. Great ball movement. And the Pines trying to counteract that right now. Cross court pass to number five, Kelly, it's good. Down it goes. The first three ball of the game 
for the Pines. Now they pass the ball up court, and Frank Powell has it. It gets stripped. Pines have it. First turnover of the game for Bishop O'Dowd. Number 20, Jesse Wood drives the lane. The layup off the glass is good. A stop, a score, and now a timeout for Bishop O'Dowd. They want to talk about it. Back comes the starting lineup out onto the court. And they're playing a little, <laughs> passing it in between each other a few times right there. Uh, Parker and Stephen Kelly. Uh, eventually they get it out to Frank Powell. And now a three ball on the way plus the foul. Wow, it goes down for Stephen Kelly. His first three ball of the game. And he'll go to the line to make it a four point play. Number 30, Lou Brooks called for the foul on that one. And now Kelly with an opportunity. And he does sink the free throw to complete the four point play. Some reserves coming in for the Pines. 25, Adam Cook in the game, along with Keith Foster, number three, and number 14, Dave Flores. Flores has the ball, sits in the right wing. Pass inside, he's got Foster. Now Foster gets it inside, but the ball, it comes loose. Left corner three now, book it! It's in there, Sean Harris drills a left corner three. And Bishop O'Dowd still finding success, moving the ball around and getting to their shots. That layup is off the mark, rebound claimed. And then looks like a foul inside on Justin Wilson. He's been a force early in this ball game. Sean Harris to inbound the ball. And he gets it into Stephen Kelly. They pass it up court. Pressure defense right here from the Pines as they're going full court press. And they're trying to get some mismatches here as well. Here comes Parker. Parker, top of the key. Doesn't know where to go with it. He gets it to Powell, Powell. He's trying to get by his defender. A little bounce pass inside to Wilson. Wilson trying to just burrow his way inside. And it looks like another offensive foul on Bishop O'Dowd. Pines able to force another turnover. And now it's Kevin Hall bringing it up the court. Pass inside and looks like another offensive foul. This time it's on the Tory Pines. And that'll be going the other way. Sean Harris inbounds to Parker. And Parker. Loses his dribble momentarily. Tries to fit one inside to Wilson. Too many bodies in there. Here come the Pines in transition. And they call a foul to slow things down. It's a good foul by Bishop O'Dowd. They don't let the Pines take advantage of the numbers down court. And now they'll have to reset on offense. Kevin Hall to inbound it. Gets it to number 30, Lou Brooks. Brooks back out to Jesse Wood. Wood back to Hall. Sitting in the right wing. Now trying to find someone. Pass inside, and they're not going to call a foul. There was no push off. That is just a straight up turnover from Kevin Hall. Ball goes out of bounds and back to Bishop O'Dowd. Timeout taken by Sean Harris. Didn't see what he liked there and didn't want to force a turnover. So now, after the timeout, they reset. And the full court press again from the Tory Pines here. They're trying to swing it around. Now a trap. Ball is out. Wilson finds his way to it. Into the hands of Kelly. Now he gets it out to Harris, who got it from the right corner. Great scrambling offense right there from Bishop O'Dowd. Able to find the open shooter and he knocks it down for three. 
Pine trying to push the pace offensively. Great pass inside to Dave Flores who's able to lay it up and in. The full court press again. Did cause issues for them last time, a near turnover, but don't forget it did turn into a three for Bishop O'Dowd, so we'll see if they stick with this defense throughout the game. Parker trying to find somewhere to go with the ball. He picks up his dribble, and now he gets it out to Frank Powell. Looked like Harris tried to lob it inside to Wilson, ends up being a turnover. Here comes Roy Torres the other way. Torres, that pass deflected by Bishop O'Dowd. It'll stay with the Pines. Couple substitutes coming in for Bishop O'Dowd, including A.J. Miller and Scott Ward, number 33. Pines have it, they get it to Roy Torres. Torres now gets it to Daniel Price. Price swings it outside. This is Jesse Wood. Wood, that little pull up, hits the back iron and it's off the mark. Stephen Kelly with the rebound. Kelly gets it to Wilson. Wilson's been very active. Now Parker, Parker drives through the scoop layup is good. Allen Parker and Sean Harris creating a lot of offense for this team. And that looks like that'll end the first quarter here. Bishop O'Dowd leads in this ball game. On the road coming in and setting the tone in this game. Here to start the second quarter. Pass inside from Kevin Hall. And it looks like the center, Chris Miller, called for the offensive foul there. It'll be going the other way. And Bishop O'Dowd forcing another turnover. Dangerous pass inside, now it's out to Kelly. His three is off the mark and a rebound for Jesse Wood. Wood out to Kevin Hall, Hall, cross court pass. He's got Roy Torres, it's a three, no! And a rebound right there from Justin Wilson. Found the open man, good pass from Hall, but Torres could not, not knock down the open shot. Swinging the ball around, they end up turning it over. It's in the hands of Kevin Hall. Now to Torres, Torres draws the foul and they'll see if it's in the act of shooting or not here. They say it is, he'll go to the free throw line for two. So the Pines trying to match that energy that Bishop O'Dowd came in here with Found a lot of offensive success early in this one. Their starting lineup has done a lot of the damage and now the more subs continue to come in for Bishop O'Dowd. As he misses the second free throw and Bishop O'Dowd is able to clean it up. So right there, it goes one for two at the line. And now we'll see how Bishop O'Dowd responds here. Parker back out, he's got Harris. Harris back to Parker. Parker thought about the three, up faked the shot, and he calls for it right back. That jump shot is off the mark, rebound, fought for, and claimed by the Torrey Pines. Cross court now, Jesse Wood, no. That would not go in for Jesse Wood. And now it's Parker. Calling out some signals, trying to tell Frank Powell to set a screen right there. Now gets it out to number 24, A.J. Miller. Back out to Parker, he'll try a three, it's good! Allen Parker nails another three-pointer, his second of the game. And Bishop O'Dowd, the shots continue to fall. Here comes Kevin Hall, Kevin trying to work by a defender. Wood back out to Hall. Hall, he'll try a corner three, but it doesn't matter because another offensive foul on the Torrey Pines would have negated the shot. Either way, it was a miss from Kevin Hall. And another turnover will give Bishop O'Dowd possession here. 
24, A.J. Miller to inbound it. And he gets it to Sean Harris. Harris has been the corner specialist in this game. And now he is in a bit of a trap here. Gets it out to Stephen Kelly. Kelly pass inside to Powell. Powell working through the defense. No, he couldn't get it to go. Chris Miller with the defensive rebound. And now it's Kevin Hall finding some space, knocking down the jumper in transition right there. Sean Harris now gets it to Powell. Powell back out to Harris. Now it's out to Stephen Kelly. Kelly, they swing it around town, 24. A.J. Miller, he's got it. The three ball, effective for Bishop O'Dowd. Powell trying to respond. And they call a foul, a loose ball foul on Bishop O'Dowd. That'll keep possession for the Torrey Pines here. But not getting the stops that they want right now. Torrey Pines trying to find some type of consistency on defense and offense too. Kevin Hall to inbound. Gets it to the top of the key to Brian Coleman. Back to Kevin Hall. Kevin Hall drives through, gets in the paint. The floater's up. It's no good. And the rebound is fought for and claimed by Bishop O'Dowd. Here they come in fast break. Harris pulls up. He's got it. No hesitation right there from Sean Harris. Got to his spot and knocks it down. Now a three ball on the edge from Jesse Wood. And that's off the mark as well. And Bishop O'Dowd still stacking up these defensive stops. Great pass back out straight away. Three on the way. Back iron. Sean Harris couldn't hit it. And the Pines come out of the pack with it. Cross court pass that time that got a little too risky and falls out of bounds. So another turnover for the Torrey Pines right there. Sean Harris to inbound the ball. He'll give it to Stephen Kelly when things get set. And now looks like a substitute coming in. So Kelly will sub out. Alan Parker checks in. And now Parker has it. Still going with the full court press here. But it looks like they're not going to trap Parker this time. They get it out to Harris. Sticking with the man-to-man -man defense here. Justin Wilson. Hands off to Parker. Parker back outside to Ward. And then Wilson inside. Misses the first. Gets his own rebound and puts it back in. Offensive rebounds have been a statement right here for Bishop O'Dowd as they continue to find success off the glass. Trying to throw a dime inside is Kevin Hall. It ends up being another turnover. Now it's a right corner three. Harris hits back iron. Rebound fought for Wilson. He's got it. He misses the putback. It's still getting poked around. Wilson looking for a foul. He's not going to get it. Torrey Pines come back with it. Roy Torres trying to cut through. He lost the ball as well. And then a foul on the Pines. Tough break right there. They fought so hard to get that defensive rebound on the other end. And then they turn it over in transition. Roy Torres losing the ball as he was trying to go up for the lay right there. So Bishop O'Dowd again. Here's Alan Parker to Wilson. Wilson, great find inside the Ward, but Ward got cut off. Now the ball's loose, and the Torrey Pines have it in transition. The layup is off, but it looks like they're going to call a foul right there. Number 25, Adam Cook could not get the shot to go, but he'll go to the line for two free throws. Cook sets his feet, and he's got the first one. So now we're finally starting to see a little bit of offensive, well, I mean, defensive success, too, 
for the Torrey Pines as well. I mean, this has been a struggle for them within this game. Um, every time that it seems Bishop O'Dowd gets a stop, they find a way to score in transition um, or off their set offense. So Pines are still looking to find a way to stop that, disrupt the offense. They have not had answers as of yet as Cook is able to hit the second free throw. And now Bishop O'Dowd back on offense. Here's Sean Harris. He's hit a couple big shots for himself. Wilson inside. Trying to post up a defender. Works his way to the rim. Misses. Tried to get his own miss. But it's claimed by the Pines. Number 14, Dave Flores comes out of the pack. Brian Coleman sinks the elbow jumper. It's good. And now they're finally starting to stack those defensive stands and get some offense in it as well. Wilson's in some trouble right now. Looking for someone to get it off to. Finally gets it into the hands of A.J. Miller. Miller gets it to, looks like it's a loose ball and it's out of bounds off Stephen Kelly. Lost control of the ball and the pressure defense right there from the Pines paying dividends. Number five, Roy Torres has the ball. An offensive foul. Pushing off right there on Stephen Kelly, trying to open himself up for a step back three. But the forearm went out a little too far. Another turnover for the Pines. Stephen Kelly passes it up court. Inside to Scott Ward. He's in trouble. Do they call a tie up or a foul? Looks like they call the foul because now it'll be side out for Bishop O'Dowd. AJ Miller to inbound this. Gets it back out to Sean Harris. Harris comes from right to left. Now gets it to Kelly. Kelly to Scott Ward. Ward inside. A missed shot and then a foul. Wilson doing all the dirty work by himself down there in the trenches. And he finds a way to manage some points out of this. Will he be able to knock down both free throws? We'll see here. So Justin Wilson. Misses the free throw. And it looks like it was last touched by the Torrey Pines here. They'll get another opportunity for it. Cross court pass to Harris. Harris now at the Scott Ward. Ward looking, waiting. He pumps, he waits, he looks, he gets it inside to Wilson. Wilson, great pass to Harris. Harris, the extra feed. Now they got a wide open shot. Scott Ward back iron. No. Wilson trying to get it. But the Pines come out with it. Roy Torres has it. Goes all the way to the cup. Oh, the roll is good. Roy Torres pushing the pace, getting the roll and the bucket. Stephen Kelly, screen from Justin Wilson. Now they give it to Wilson inside. Ward, oh, the easy lane right there. What a dime from Wilson. That's why it's so important to have a center who could pass the ball knows exactly how that paint is being occupied at all times. Brian Coleman has it now, trying to work some ISO here with Sean Harris in front of him. Now Roy Torres, Roy, back out to Coleman. Coleman blocked away by Wilson. Phenomenal defensive effort right there from Justin Wilson. He saw it coming the whole way, and he's got his mitts on that one. Some more substitutions come for the Pines. Lou Brooks checking into the game. And Jesse Wood coming back in as well.
Here's a three ball from Torres. Brian Coleman able to get the offensive rebound and he puts it back in. Thirty-seven to twenty-two is that'll end the second quarter here, and now the second half will start. So a fifteen-point deficit for the hometown Tory Pines. Can they find a way to come back in this ball game? Their first possession to open up the second half. Ball is scrambled around a bit. Now they get it back up to Kevin Hall. Hall looking for somewhere to go with it. Passes back out. And now it's Kevin Hall again with it at the top of the key. His jumper hits back iron and falls off the rim. Bishop O'Dowd with the rebound. Trying to work the floor here. Number 20, Frank Powell finds his way inside and scores for the first time since the first quarter of play. Pines trying to come back quickly with it. Ball is loose. And it looks like it was off Parker last, so it'll stay with the Pines, but not the offensive possession they really wanted there. Really pushing the pace after the Bishop O'Dowd was able to score in transition, and they nearly ended up with another turnover right there. Kevin Hall, the point guard, to inbound. And Jesse Wood takes it in all the way. Jesse Wood, a great little head and shoulder fake. And he got to the cup. He got his defender off balance. Got the layup. Trying to thread the needle inside is Kelly. And now Harris to Wilson. Wilson lost the ball, but it'll stay with Bishop O'Dowd. Touched last by Brian Coleman. Sean Harris to inbound this ball. Wilson was calling for it and said it's inside to Powell. Powell working the post moves. That was beautiful. Inside Tim Duncan S right there. Able to get the deuce. Kevin Hall again really trying to reset this offense. Tipped in the air by Kelly and taken by Bishop O'Dowd. Another turnover. For the Torrey Pines, it is not their day today. Bishop O'Dowd is very active on defense. Hands everywhere. Now they're trying to get Kelly for a tie-up. Possession will stay with Bishop O'Dowd. Frank Powell. Trying to inbound it without turning it over. Good pressure defense right here from the Torrey Pines. Kelly has it. Kelly, now to Powell. Powell, great feed inside to Wilson. Blocked away by Coleman. What an effort right there. Able to get his hands on the ball. And now wide open inside. Lou Brooks gets the deuce. Excellent transition offense from the Pines. That's exactly what they need. To come back within this ball game. Oh, that pass is stolen by Hall, who dunks it home. Kevin Hall, the athletic interception, able to score in a timeout now from Bishop O'Dowd. Coming back after the timeout, that was an incredible steal and score right there from Kevin Hall. And we'll see how Bishop O'Dowd responds to it now. Passing it to each other in the backcourt. They got to be careful right now of a backcourt. Oof. They were taking a little too long right there. Powell. Oh, the reverse layup is good. Frank Powell continues to attack the paint and continues to find success. Cross court pass to Torres. Off his own foot. Thankfully, Jesse Wood is there. Wood. That layup is off, and it ends up in the hands of Justin Wilson. Now, Allen Parker, the pull-up. Oh, strike a pose, Allen. He's got it. Allen Parker shooting very well from the field right now. 
And now it's Wood. Wood on two defenders, able to draw the foul. And he'll go to the line. Got to be careful with Bishop O'Dowd, how they're passing the ball to each other. Many times in the backcourt, you do not want to get called right there for eight-second violation. First free throw is good for Jesse Wood. Substitutes come in for Bishop O'Dowd as Scott Ward checks back into the game. Parker able to get the inbound. He gets it up to Wilson. And Ward looks like he almost got tied up, but they're going to end up calling a foul on the Torrey Pines. Sticking with the pressure defense throughout this game. They have a game plan, and they are sticking to it no matter what the scoreboard reads. Parker gets it in the backcourt. Trying to get by two defenders. Oh, an Aaron pass. And he was trying to tell number 11, Sean Harris, no, no, go inside, inside the paint. That's where he was trying to get that one. Instead, kind of stood by the baseline. Ends up being a turnover for Bishop O'Dowd. Jesse Wood has it. Guarded by Scott War. Here's Roy Torres. Roy, great pass inside to Coleman. Coleman, extra feed. No, it's off the mark, but they call a foul. Great ball movement right there. Luke Brooks going up with the shot and getting fouled. And he'll go with the charity stripe. Lou Brooks. Able to sink the first free throw. And right there is a definition of using teamwork to reward your own teammates. Everybody's active with the ball. Everybody knows the situation that's going on. And the more the ball moves, the more likely you'll find an open guy. One for two at the line goes Brooks. And Bishop O'Dowd comes back with it here. Sean Harris inside to Wilson. Wilson hands off to Parker. Parker swings it to Stephen Kelly. Pass inside to Harris, who was fouled on the entry pass. And now after being fouled, Sean Harris will be inbounding the ball. Looking for someone to give it to, he finds Parker. Parker guarded by Kevin Hall, Parker. Now to Kelly, swing it to Harris. Wilson calls for it in the post. Wilson fakes a pass inside. Now back out. Ward almost had an open shot. Now back to Wilson. Good two-man game right there, and it pays off as Justin Wilson is fouled, and he'll go to the free throw line. Looked like some 70s style basketball right there, just moving it. Back to the big man, back out, back to the big man as first free throw hits front iron. Wilson able to redeem himself on the second. He gets the bounce. So Bishop O'Dowd able to come away with some points on that possession. Here comes Kevin Hall. The left wing three is off. Active on the boards is number 25, Adam Cook. We'll see which way it goes here. It's going to stay with the Torrey Pines. So Adam Cook finding a way to get dirty inside the paint right there. And he gives his team an extra possession. Pass off the foot of Alan Parker. So they'll reset again. And now they get it to Adam Cook. Swing it around. Flores, Flores, the Torres, who misses the shot, able to come back, get the strip. No, that layup is off too. And Wilson finally gets the rebound. Oh, great efforts by the Pines. And then in transition, Parker. Finds his way to the rim. Wide open layup. 
Oh, that was just a tough break from the Pines. Torres missing the first shot, getting the steal though. And he misses again, Ward another rebound. Definitely gotta give credit to the effort right there. Getting that steal. Now Harris is heckled right now. Looks like they're gonna call a travel on Harris. Off that mischange right there, he was pressured. And the Torrey Pines able to force a turnover. Cook, great pass out to Flores, but an offensive foul right there. Plenty of turnovers in this contest. Both teams pretty loose with the ball. Kelly. He is trapped. He needs help. And he ends up getting fouled out of it. Actually comes out limping as well. The foul saves him right there. Sean Harris to inbound, gets it to Allen Parker. Finally able to <laughs> get across half court. That's definitely been the problem for them within this game. Oh, what a dime inside. Wilson finds Scott Ward. What a pass. What a play. This center has been throwing out dimes. Justin Wilson, another assist. And now a good jumper right there from Jesse Wood. Sean Harris has it now, gets it to Wilson. Wilson takes a dribble, needs some help. Ball is tipped in the air and stolen by the Pines. They're taking too much time to get it across half court and it keeps forcing them into these turnovers. Wood, a spin inside, blocked away from Wilson. My goodness, what a block from Justin Wilson. Ward has it. Kicks it to the right corner. Now it's Wilson again. He's got the layup off the glass. Justin Wilson. Reward the big fella. Active on both ends of the floor. He gets the deuce. Jesse Wood. The little float shot soft, and it looks like I thought it touched Harris last, but the ref saw something different. It's gonna go to Bishop O'Dowd. O'Dowd inbounds it to Stephen Kelly. Kelly. Now to Harris. They find their way across half court. Penetrating the lane and dishing out. Stephen Kelly has it. Back out to Harris. Harris trying to get past the defender. And it looks like it might be a blocking foul right there. So Bishop O'Dowd will get reset. Parker to Ward, Ward looking for Kelly, he gets it to him, now to Harris, moving the ball around, Frank Powell has it, the post move, does it work this time? Yes it does, Frank Powell, every time he comes into the game, he is an absolute impact on the offensive glass and inside the paint. Ball is stripped away from Lou Brooks, here comes Bishop O'Dowd, Parker. Resets the offense, tells everybody to get into their position. Harris, too high, and it's stolen away. Flores passes up court. Now it's Roy Torres, a three, no! But the tip-in is good! Dave Flores, the effort to be there, and actually Harris might have helped that shot to go in as he was just trying to get to the ball. 
A very good basketball from the Pines right there. Able to work the offensive rebound. Now a left wing three off. Roy Torres looked like he might have been the last one to touch it. Instead, they rule it. It'll stay with the Pines and say it's off Stephen Kelly. Pass inside. Oh, he had a wide open layup. But Jesse Good misses. Wilson. Inside to Kelly. Kelly. Back out to Parker. Too deep for a three. And now I'll try to drive inside. A little bounce pass, but ends up being a turnover. And Powell signaling that he was open in the low post. Parker did not see him. And the Pines will take over. Kevin Hall has the ball. The layup from Brian Coleman right there is no good, but a foul. So he'll go to the free throw line here. Good to have some offensive consistency finally for the Torrey Pines. But the only problem is their defense still not coming up with enough stops to take a bigger lead within this game, to take any lead at all, actually. Bishop O'Dowd has taken it from the jump, and the Pines have never led throughout this entire game. Second free throw, hits the back iron, and cleared by Justin Wilson. Here comes the pressure defense again. Kelly, they swing it around. Parker, thought he had Harris in the right corner. He got covered up. Now a little two-man game. Wilson and Powell, Powell, that jumper way off the mark. Doesn't even draw iron, hits the backboard. And now Kevin Hall getting erratic with the ball right there and another turnover. Parker, bounce pass inside. Powell with the lay, it's good. Torres misses the shot, and it's Wilson with the rebound. And it looks like they're calling a foul on the Pines. Harris gets the inbound pass into Parker. They swing it around a couple times. Have to hurry across half court. And now it's Pat. Not primarily a ball handler. Oh, Harris is wide open inside. That's an easy layup. Poor defense right there from the Torrey Pines. You can see the frustration starting to boil over a bit. Another offensive foul here. And the Bishop O'Dowd has come in and dominated from start to finish in this ball game. We'll see if there's any heart left in the Torrey Pines Try to find a way to come back. Number five, Stephen Kelly has it. Gets it up to Wilson. Wilson again looking for help. Hands it off to Parker. Parker, great defense right there from Kevin Hall. They swing it around again. Stephen Kelly. Now to Frank Powell. Powell gets it to Harris. Good defense right here from the Torrey Pines. Now they swing into Kelly again. That three ball is off the mark. And a rebound for the Torrey Pines. Here comes Jesse Wood. Forces a shot. That's no good. Floor has got the rebound. Tried to go back up with it. And it's blocked away by Justin Wilson again. Definitely a nominee for player of the game right now. Wilson. Active everywhere on the floor right now, setting screens, playing great offense and defense. And he's been rewarded so far throughout. Kelly trying to get by Hall right now. Kelly, the little hop step inside. The layup is good. And now the Torrey Pines will inbound again.
Kevin Hall has the ball. And he dribbles to the right wing. Hall, not a pal. And that jumper is good. Jesse Wood able to hit another one here. Here comes Eric Harris. Harris flips it outside to Frank Powell. Powell has it. Gets it to Parker. Parker. Looking for somewhere to go with it. Finally gets it to Powell. Trying to run a pick and roll action right there. And said Stephen Kelly has a three and an air ball. Wilson able to get it back. Oh, the little hook shot is good. And he's excited. It's Justin Wilson pumping his hands in celebration. A foul right there on the rebound. Justin Wilson making play after play, saving his teammate from the embarrassing air ball right there. And the hook shot back in. You could see how excited he was coming back down the court on defense. Whoa, that pass is way too high. Ends up being a turnover. Kevin Hall has it. Dish inside. Oh, another block from Wilson. You can't go in there. It's a forest. Phenomenal defense inside the paint. And that's not happening in his house. Chris Miller able to get it. And now Keith Foster, it looks like he fell and it was actually fouled by number five, Stephen Kelly. So Foster to inbound the ball. Gets it now to number 34, Larry Morris. Morris to Foster, Foster, bank shot is off, ball is tipped around, still loose on the floor, Pines have it, and they call a foul. It was Mark Johnson, number 21, coming out of the pile with it. Ball will stay with the Pines here. As you see, a lot of substitutes have come in along with Daniel Price. Larry Morris, Chris Miller, and Mark Johnson as well for the Pines. Foster gets it into the backcourt. And inside layup is good for Larry Morris. So making the most of his opportunity in this game right now. Haven't seen him a lot. And here come the uh, Bishop O'Dowd again, but looks like it's going to be another foul on the floor. Wilson exchanging some words with Scott Ward. Might be in terms of their effectiveness of getting the ball past the half court. Foul right there on Frank Powell. He'll shoot two free throws. Something that was evident in this game from the start was Bishop O'Dowd came out with a very fast-paced offense, moving it around very frequently. And even though they did have a good amount of turnovers, it seemed that Torrey Pines had about double the amount. Um, and, and that was a big reason why they struggled throughout this one. As in transition, it's Parker gets the layup to go off the glass and in. That should just write about a finish to this one. As the Torrey Pines never were able to get stops consistently, never able really to get comfortable in the rhythm of their own offense. And the impressive thing for Bishop O'Dowd coming on the road and setting the tone from the start of the game. So you gotta give credit where it's due right now. Parker running around with it. 
Gets it to Ward. Ward. Back out to Kelly. Simply just trying to protect the ball at this point of the game. Good screen from Wilson. Off the pick and roll. He didn't get the ball. Instead, an outside jumper is good for Frank Powell. Still good effort right now from both sides. You got to respect that, especially Bishop O'Dowd with the big lead, still playing hard on defense. And now a couple more substitutes coming in as well. Number 13, Joe Perez. Checks in for Bishop O'Dowd along with number one, Russell Hill. So Hill immediately comes in the game and is forced into a trap. Uh, they're trying to get the ball off. Yep, yep, there it is. And they try to get it past half court. Took a little too long right there that time. And Russell Hill and Aaron Ross, number three, they got their fair share of this full court press defense that the Pines have been coming out with all game. Pass inside to Miller. Looks like he was fouled on that entry pass. They get it inside the middle again. Great one hand snag to get the ball. And looks like he's fouled again. So uh, very similar to the first play he was fouled on. And now he'll go to the free throw line. Both teams trying to end this game on a positive note. Now, obviously, a lot of the starters have come out at this point, but I think as a coach, you know, these are the moments where you really get to see um, those significant bench players, if they could find ways, you know, can they show something in their game that they haven't seen in practice as Foster fighting hard on the offensive rebound. Miller misses both, but Foster able to get him right back to the line. Just Little things like that, those extra effort plays, you know, can you see a player um, show something that he maybe couldn't show in practice or didn't show in practice um, that he was able to do in a game. So definitely for scouting reasons, it's very important. And I know for many fans, you know, at this point, look, obviously you're just waiting for the game to be over. You know it's a blowout. You know it's over. Um, but, you know, it, as cliche as it sounds, every minute every second in sports is important for some reason or another you know and that might not even be in terms of winning or losing the ball game pass nearly turned over foster able to get his hands on it again and another foul so <laughs> while many people may be waiting for this game to just dribble out the last couple of seconds no pun intended right there um Keith Foster has other ideas. You know, he is fighting hard right now, working those offensive boards, continues to get to the free throw line. The first one's off and um, giving his teams other opportunities, keeping the fighting spirit down the stretch. And that's something that is very important, especially in youth sports. Bishop O'Dowd again as Foster hit the second free throw. And Aaron Ross. Trying to get by Foster right now. Hands off to Russell Hill. And it looks like it's going to be another turnover right there. Keith Foster. Horse into some trouble. He gets the ball back from Larry Morris. Pass inside to Miller. Miller. And Miller draws another foul. So there's definitely a size advantage that the Pines have right now with this reserve unit. As you see Foster talking with his head coach right there. As Miller will go to the free throw line and shoot two. Hits the first one. After missing both his last outing at the charity strike.
Miller. Can't get the second. Another offensive rebound for the Pines. The putback is off. And finally, the Bishop O'Dowd come away with it. Wide open layup is good for Aaron Ross. And the starters cheering for their team right now. Able to come away with a big win on the road. Another wide open outlet pass to Bishop O'Dowd and they score again. Sooner or later, they'll be looking to dribble this one out, but for the time being, still fighting for those extra buckets. Ball sitting on the rim, it's off. Another offensive rebound, put back. It's off the mark, but the buzzer sounds, it's over. Final score, 66 to 45. Bishop O'Dowd comes away with a win in this game. A great game between both teams. And I'll catch you next time on another broadcast.